Oh, hi, you must be Mrs. Agnes. Please come on in. Good afternoon. Where are my manners? My name is Dr. Lucy Ferris. Um, I'm gonna be your counselor today. Your children are my regulars, and so it is just really nice to have you in today. Uh, please, you know, make yourself comfortable. Praise, Papa. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. Oh, yeah, bring your head. Bring your head. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Papa. Um, you are worthy to be praised. And no one's ever done that for me before. Thank you. It's very sweet of you. Good. Like that. Oh, oh, Jehovah. Thank you. Mm. We can go ahead and get started with our session today. Okay. How do people do this? Anyway, what I will do is um, first, I will open us in praise and worship. Shebi, you know Agatha Moses. <laughs> then you follow me. Then I will open us in prayers. Okay, then we will commence. Okay, let me stand up. This one that I'm sitting down. It's gonna be an interesting one. <laughs> my Lord Renet, let the earth tremble. My Lord Renet, let the earth. Doctor Jesus Renet, let the earth tremble. Daddy Renet, let the earth. Darling Jesus, you Renet, let the earth tremble. I'm running out of time, so let's go ahead and just just get started. All right. Um, I actually try not to incorporate religion into oh, my God. practice, and so um, we don't have to do any of that. I like to leave that out. <laughs> so you are hosting meeting. And you don't pray, no praise and worship, which means that you are operating with a satanic spirit. Excuse me? Hey? So these children have now managed to bring me to a demonic convention. Yay. Jesus. All right. Uh, Mrs. Agnes, uh, tell me about yourself. Why? For what? Who sent you? Did somebody send you? It was Mama Kechi. You are one of her witches. You are the employee of the month, Abby. I said it. I said it. I said that Mama Kechi will not rest until she has released all of her witches. I said it. That woman will not have peace until she has turned everybody into yam. Yeah. Uh, so, so no one sent me. It's just a question that I ask my clients. It, it helps me to get to know who you are. Hmm. Okay. I don't know who I am. Uh, Mrs. Miss Agnes, how do you feel uh, about the words, I love you and I apologize? Apologize for what? To whom? I mean, let somebody hear what? All right, let's move on. You know, growing up, kids need to hear words of affirmation. So for example, when a child does something well, they want to hear their parents say, Hey bud, I'm proud of you. I love you. Good job. Why should I have to say that I am proud of you when you are only receiving 98 on your exam? So you want me to be celebrating shame? Have you heard of the term trauma? Oh, about trauma. Now, which one is trauma? Huh? Which one is trauma again? Well, trauma is when we go through a disturbing experience and oftentimes when we don't heal from that experience, we tend to repeat the cycle with our children. But then let me tell you something. When I came to this country, I came with swim, nothing, but I walked so that my children can have education. My children have not opened their mouth once to be begging for bread. So what are you talking? It's only because they are in America that they are crying. All this, I love you, I am proud of you, I apologize. Mm -mm, leave it, leave that one. That is Oyibo language. That one is for the white people. Uh -huh, my dear, come, let me ask you a question. What's that your name again? Um, Dr. Lucy Fair. Mm -hmm. Madam Lucifer. That's, that's not what I said. When you we are growing up, how we are your parents? Uh, well, uh, my parents, they were very successful. They had an international business. They were really busy a lot of the time and um, you know, my nanny, I call her like my second mom. She practically raised me. Um, I said it. So, your parents, they had money. Still yet, they gave you to a complete stranger. 
to raise you and then they left you. Do you know why? Because you are troublesome and you don't know God. So they ran away from you. So my dear, before you come and talk to me about my children, go and locate your parents. Yeah? Go and find them. If they are not still running away from you. Then you ask them what is love. I'm only here because my children said they will buy me handbag. I don't care for all this your juju conversation. So just don't bother yourself with my children. They are okay. Do you know why? Because we have God. But I know that you wouldn't understand. Because you fellowship with many, many witches. So please, if you'll excuse me, eh? I have to come and be going. I have handbag waiting for me. Ah! No sense. You want to come and talk to me about my family. Look at, look at her, look at her. You don't even know where your parents are. They are running away from you. Where are they? You don't know. No sense. Now, how does that make you feel? Uh. I see. But Lucy, this concludes our session for today. But you know what? We can pick it up next week. No, 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 don't leave, don't leave. Don't leave me, don't, don't leave me.